Hello guys, welcome to the training video. Today I will be teaching you how to fade one side of an image in Photoshop. So here I have my image opened up. So all you need to do is add a layer mask to it and I will show you how to do that. You just need to navigate to your layers panel here. If you don't have your layers panel opened up, you can come up to the window menu here on top and click on layers. Once your layers panel has opened up, you can come all the way at the bottom here which says add a layer mask just click on this and it will add a layer mask here now what we'll be doing is uh, filling it from black to white so make sure your foreground color at the toolbar on the left is set to black and white and then click here on the gradient tool and then come up here on the top double click on this and it will open the gradient editor make sure this side is set to black and this side is set to white you can change the colors if these are not set and if you have any other colors you can just double click on this and it will pop up the color picker and you can just select your color from there as well as uh, default in the presets the black and white will be here you can just click on this and just hit ok and to add a fading effect to this image just click and drag with the mouse like so and it will give that one sided fade image and I'll just hit undo and I'll just uh, drag it from the top corner you can see it will give a gradient from that side and uh, I'll hit undo again and I'll show you one another way if you hold down shift and click and drag there will be a straight line which will give you a straight gradient same way you can do from top to bottom while holding down shift it will give a fading effect from the top then you can also do from bottom to top you can see on the right in the layers panel the layers mask that's the one that's getting affected and not the actual image so this is one simple and easy way to add uh, one sided fit effect on an image in Photoshop. I hope you guys have learned something from this training video. Please do shoot me an email if you have any questions to ask. I'll be happy to answer them. Do subscribe to my YouTube channel. I'll be posting more videos soon. Thanks for watching, guys.